The process as such starts with the, the making of powder. You store that in, in uh, stainless steel containers under inert uh, protection. Then you design the form, the shape of the item, making that in a capsule with sheet metal forming a little bit larger than the finished component because it shrinks during hot isostatic pressing. Then you take the powder from the storage containers, fill it in, you evacuate and seal, and then put it in the hip unit. You pressurize and heat it up to a roughly 1100 degrees C under enormous pressure of 1000 bars. You keep it there for some hours and it's ready, fully dense. It's not almost dense, it's fully dense. The properties are extraordinary because they are isotropic and everywhere in the component they have the same amount or the same property level. I've been involved with powder technology since mid-80s and it's been a thrilling experience for a young engineer because this is the best thing of metal metallurgy you can find. Rapid solidification with much nicer microstructure than you can ever see in, in something else. I believe we are getting bigger and bigger and we are expanding into more demanding applications. The process at SAS is environmental friendly. You can preserve the energy, you can take care of the, uh, the heat from, from making the powder. You can also restore the uh, the energy when you hit, so it's almost uh, no exploration to the, the environment. Then it's also raw material conservative, better material yield, so we use less material, which is also an environmental friendly thing.